That Chanel shit, I like that Got your own ride, I like that Got your mind right, I like that In a fantasy world, I wife that And I'm back with another day in the life of a stripper vlog. If this is your first time coming across my channel, hello, welcome. My name is Tiffany and I am a New York City stripper, dancer, whatever you want to call it. Today we are going to the gym, laser hair removal, and I am getting my hair done today. And not only that, we are going to Le Booty Club to make some money so you guys need to come along with me for all of that and tonight's kind of cool because i have a customer coming out for me so you guys get to see the difference between having a customer come out for you versus having to meet new people and socialize with new people and make money that way when you have a customer come out for you it's guaranteed money it's easy money and it just it's just it's just better i usually don't have customers come out for me anymore i used to all the time you want to know what happened i changed my number the beginning on january 1st i cut everybody off when the ball dropped and i was just like you know what i don't want to give my number out anymore so i stopped doing that and you know I, I lost customers. I lost customers because that I did have a text free number that I was giving out to people, but then it got all messed up. So then I was just like, it is what it is. I don't need customers coming out for me to make money anyway. But it's just easier when they are there. So I am about to go get my second round of laser hair removal at the Cormady Spa in Queens, New York. You guys know I'm hairy. You see my during plenty of videos. You see all of this stuff. You guys know your girl's hairy. And I did my first round of laser hair removal under my armpits. And may I tell you, the results were phenomenal. I was so surprised with how little hair grew back from just the first round. I'm definitely going to do laser hair removal on my legs, my Brazilian, which is your cooler area, and my booty because my booty is hairy. If you guys come and check out the core Medi Spa in Queens and you mention my name, then you get an extra 15% off whatever procedure you're gonna get done. So that's a very good deal and they're not expensive to begin with. So, so let's make our way. Yeah. Oh my gosh, does the legs hurt a lot? It's not bad. Only like on the ankles I feel like it hurts and like yeah. on the shin bone. When you get waxes too down by the ankles, that hurts the most. It hurts a lot. When I used to get waxes, I would get Brazilian, I would get everything done. Yeah. But my legs hurt the most. But with this, even it's like, it's a lot from the first time. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh, I've seen that. Yeah. Okay, so it is hair time. I'm getting my hair done by at Custom by Hina. She's located in Queens, New York. The first thing she's doing is putting the stocking cap on my big old head. And I'm going to be putting a full lace wig on by Nadula Hair. I will leave all the links to everything down below. I am so ticklish so when she puts the blow dryer by my neck, I just can't 
help but to laugh and I just give her a hard time. But I'm so ticklish. It doesn't hurt. It just tickles a lot. And she's sewing down the stocking cap to my head. Now the hair that you guys will see me applying in this video, I genuinely love. I've worked with Nadula hair before and I love their hair. I love their lace. Everything about them is good. The pricing, everything. So I definitely recommend Nadula hair. She's putting on concealer on the wig cap to make it blend, make it look like scalp. All you need is a concealer that matches your skin tone or as close to it as possible. And as you can see, she's applying multiple layers of the bold hold glue to my forehead. Not to my hairline, but to my forehead. And she's doing that because you want the wig to be secured, ladies. I've seen a whole bunch of girls' wigs fall off at work. So she's putting on three layers this time. This is a full lace wig by Nadula Hair. I will leave the links to everything down below. The wig is 180 density, so it's super thick. That's why we decided to do the half up, half down, even though I did end up taking it down because it made me look too young. But she's cutting the lace off with a flat razor because it makes it look more natural. And if you guys want to get that nice, sleek, flat hair, then you really have to use a hot comb. I highly recommend that you invest in a hot comb it really gets the job done like if you want that flat arrogant tay look you gotta do the hot comb putting some baby hairs around my edges using mousse it's called nairobi mousse ten dollars like ten dollars it works really good and it gets the job done and once you have your baby hairs laid you want to you want to tie them up while you work on the rest of the head and you can see how sleek the ponytail is just from the mousse, hairspray, and the hot comb alone. So once that's done, there you go, my hair, bada boom, bada bang. You can see how good my hair looks. This hair is from Nudula Hair, so if you guys are interested in purchasing it, I will leave all the links for you down below. Hey guys, so I'm on my way to work now. I didn't do my lips or put on my lashes. I'm just going to do that when I get there. And I also took the half up, half down, the ponytail down because it made me look way too young. And I kept getting comments by my age and I had went out to eat and they ID'd me because I got a drink. And the guy didn't want to give it to me because he thought that I was like too young. So, so I'm about to head over to work, and I'll see you guys when I. Come. So it's my outfit for today. I have on this top, which is actually from my website. So I'm leaving it below. I'm over I have to wear tape because it's a little see-through, and you can't show any type of nipple. So it is after work and I'm in my car and I'm happy because I made some money. The money was so late today. It was like after 2 30. But that's really how New York City is. Like people come out late. This is not all the time, but typically the people who come later than the most. So I'm going to go home. I'm going to count the money in the morning so that I can have a loud conversation with you guys. But it's gonna be in this video. So you don't have to worry about that. Cause I know last time I didn't so well. So when the club is over and all the people are outside, all the guys are outside just waiting for God knows what. And I could just tell like, you know, they're going to try to talk to me or whatever. So I start singing. You guys know, the, um, there ain't no bugs on me. There ain't no bugs on me. There may be bugs on some of you bugs, but there ain't no bugs. I do a remix that goes like, please don't talk to me. Please don't talk to me. Please don't talk to me. And I sing that shit to myself. And they look at me like I'm crazy because I am. All right, let me get out of here. It's time for me to go because there's people coming around here. I don't want nobody to see my pretty ass up. Like, this is what you got. Sometimes you just got to hide, yo. I just don't be wanting nobody to bother me. No funny, like, 
I don't want people seeing what car I drive. I don't want people seeing anything. That's none of their business. And then I remember one time I had this guy who was cool, whatever. I don't know what he thought, what type of party he thought it was, what what's going on, or whatever. But he had the audacity to boom, come up to my I was scared as hell. He had the audacity to just come up to my car. I seen his ass in the fucking corner. And ever since that day, when I, I started parking in the cut, because that's where you gotta park, like, in the cut, but not the cut cut, you know what I'm saying? Far enough so people don't mess with you, but close enough so if somebody does mess with you, the security's right there. So yeah, I need a personal bodyguard, that's what I want. That is the goal for me, because I have a personal bodyguard. Okay, so what I was thinking is getting a new phone. I have, I'm gonna keep this phone, and then I'm gonna get another phone. That was gonna be my personal phone, and then this one I'll put, like, business. So the hoes and the business. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm finna do, bro. All right, let me get out of here, man. I'm sick of these. Everybody looking at me recording myself like I'm maniac next something. day and I'm going to cut my money this is my bag from last night I had my customer and then I ran to somebody else that I knew so I have my rubber bands here so I think I'm gonna do a Q&A video about the club and stuff because I get so many DMs, like it's literally impossible for me to reply to everybody, so I, w I just wanna do a Q&A video. If you want one of your questions to be answered, then you have to follow me on Instagram because I will be putting up in my story one of those little question box thingies so you guys can ask me some questions and I'll answer them on a video. So my new Instagram name is at Tiffany B with two Y's. I'm so happy I finally got my name. Just watch out for that story. I'll probably have it posted. I'll put the question box up a couple times just so everybody gets a chance to see it and to ask a question. And I'll just answer whatever questions I feel like are the best or the most common. Let me just count the first batch of singles that I have in my hand. Okay, so I got my first batch of singles right here. This is 100 And then he also gave me a $100 bill, my customer, so. Okay, let me count the next batch. These are 425s, if you're wondering. I always do this in all my counting videos and stuff like that. So 425s is 100 So we're at our next 100 And then I still have some left from that pile that I was doing. Twenty five. More. I said I'm more to count. Okay, so my camera keeps overheating and it is on 12%. So I had to so I had to just gather the last bit off camera. This is the last bit that I have left to count. And then I have this. So this is $35 right here. 35, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. Sorry right now. Sorry I'm rushing because I, my camera is going to shut off any moment and I look like the grudge. Yes, that is all for my video guys. I hope you enjoyed your day. I enjoyed watching this video and I will see you guys next time.